hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel in today's video we are going to be doing um, a day in my life and on this particular morning i woke up early and i went ahead and organized the living room since we always leave it in a mess every night that is the first thing i always do when i wake up I want to say a big thank you to everyone who watches my video and not only watching but watching till the end. Thank you so much for that kind of support. I really appreciate you and even for subscribing and even for liking my videos. I don't take that for granted. Nowadays I tend to leave my kitchen clean every night so that in the morning I won't have a lot of chores to do. That's why I'm only going to clean up the living room and then uh, I'll start other things. But the kitchen is actually clean by this time.
Nowadays, I like taking water in the morning before taking anything for breakfast. So my daughter has been playing with the water dispenser and she has been pouring water in this uh, thing that I'm carrying right now. And that is what I was going to pour out. I like taking a minute to just uh, read the Bible and pray and just tell God thank you for all that he has been doing for me. But even before I leave the bed, I always take a minute to just thank him and then I wake up and then I start doing my things. After finishing with my prayer, I went ahead and did some exercises because I'm still on my weight loss journey. And someone told me I should try coffee and lemon and some warm water, and that is what I've been doing. So I'm going to give myself time, like four weeks, and um, let's say the end of September, I'm going to tell you what I weigh. And currently, the last time I, I weighed myself, I was 71 kgs. So uh, I'm looking to get to 60, 61 there. So uh, I will tell you about it. Take me to church with your love. You took me down to the river. Gave me a new start. It's different now with no sinners. Breaking my heart, and I don't feel the hurt. I used to be made up. Cause you take me to church. So this is the Chinese uh, exercise uh, for losing tummy. I've been seeing it on TikTok a lot and I decided I'll be doing it every day because it says it works effectively. Life lately, my daughter likes sleeping down here. <laughs> Mommy, enjoy yourself.
So here we were talking with my husband. Uh, our daughter lately uh, wants to wear dresses a lot. All the time she wants to wear dresses. And she doesn't have so many dresses. Like we have not bought her a lot of dresses. So she every time she wants to wear a dress, and it's this kid that she has been watching on TV, uh, this kid wears a lot of dresses all the time. So my kids, it's like trying to imitate that kid, and I don't know what we are going to do. Uh, kindly advise down, the, down there and tell me if your kid has ever behaved like that uh, at that age. Our plan was uh, to like buy her more dresses, uh, which we are going to do soon. And yeah, hope that is going to solve it because we don't know. I'm a a few dresses and she wants to wear them every day, like every morning. I came to the closet and I took two dresses and I took an attack. This was after dinner. We had already finished eating. And I went ahead and cleaned my kitchen. As I, as I told you, I like leaving my kitchen clean. So that is what I was doing here, cleaning up. Forget you. You're all I know, what I need. 
After I finished cleaning the kitchen, I went ahead and removed the trash outside because I don't like it uh, staying inside uh, because of the smell. And then I later took a shower and that was all I did on that day. If I could lay down beside you, I would, I would. When nothing really matters, that's all I want to do. I hope that you are safe and that I will see you soon. If I could lay down beside you, I would, I would. If I could lay down beside you, I would, I would. When nothing really matters, that's all I want to do. I hope that you are safe and that I will see you soon. If I could lay down beside you, I would, I would. So guys, I DIY'd these uh, dummy books, <laughs> I used cartons and um, the contact paper that we had bought to put here, uh, in it look at my, to my ribu, I used it on this, uh, yeah, to cover this and they look so good, <laughs> although I didn't do uh, good on the covering, but I can say I tried because I used cartons, can you imagine, I made three of them, these are dummy books. Then uh, I love this setup. I really love, love it. Uh, where I put my spoons, my cooking oil. This is vinegar. Uh, this cooking oil, nile in ashikana, but indo tui mebaki. So uh, once it's over, I'll clean this up and put fresh oil here. So yeah, I love it. Actually, I'm doing a lot of DIYs, guys. So um, I'll definitely show you uh, what I'm working on. Once it's finished and I'm sure you'll like it. So guys, I wanted to tell you about these hoodies that my hubby is selling. Uh, here the, it's written Mixologist Amor Cocktail Experience. And here it has the Kenyan flag. And on this other side it's... Uh, Hashtag mixologist a more cocktail experience. So it, it comes in all sizes, all colors, and even t-shirts. So if you like one, you can kindly uh, DM him on his Instagram page. Uh, mine looks a bit dirty, but they are really nice. And even the inside, they are really warm. So uh, if you like it, I'll give you the Instagram handle. I'll, I'll pin it down here. So that you can go ahead and order yours and even t-shirts and yeah just go ahead and dm him and you can get yours <laughs> 